Oh, I broke her back with clue. So she's got to default down. I mean, she believes that that's the way to get attention now. So you've got to keep reinforcing that. Oh, ay, ay, ay. Is all excited. Yay, yay, yay. I don't have the collar on yet, but when you first get home and you're petting it, and even if you're saying don't jump up and ah, moving your hands around. So I wasn't fast, but I was giving the impression of. Yay, yay, yay. Yay. So that kind of helped her figure out, you know, listen, I'm not coming over there. I'm exhausted. Oh, they get me up at 2.30 now. That's why, Courtney, we're, uh, let's get, uh, I, I threw that big one as, as a, you know, that's where they've got to, she's got to understand. We need to marry these two things together, going over by her and the thing. Oh, that was the big one too, Brooke. All right, there's one more behind there, so. Yeah, I think honestly, if they're kind of in an awkward position, you, it's even more of them saying, what the hell is it looking at? You've got to do like the mannequin challenge. She doesn't see it. Remember, there's the head pull away. We don't fall for that one. If they come up and get in your face, all right, and she doesn't see it, so I don't want to make it too hard. Yeah, there, okay. Yeah. Yay! So I, you know, she understands now, and you, you, you just got to be ready to do that. That if I, I'm starting to get it, I'm, I'm going through with my, uh, I'm going through with my end of the deal. But as soon as I see, bam. All right, so you just right here one more time. Oh, Skylar made it back from the pond. All right, I'm gonna get the collar on first. So remember, what you've got to do is have a long collar. And I always, always, this one's got the weaker pager. I always just get in the habit of, and, and it does hear that. I, I am, I used to think the audibility had nothing to do with it until last Tuesday. Now I think it has everything to do with it because it's going to that, the certain part of the brain. Okay, so remember, you're just making a hoop with the collar. I think the platform helps. And you're just making it, you know, this is the kind of thing you should have, like timed events. Now, these would be good workshops and stuff to have, you know, share if you want to do one for other trainers. And how to get the collar on, and I've got a deliberate buy. All right, so let me get my things back. And I'm not doing anything with the collar. I'm on zero. I just had to get rid of some guy that put uh, sad, hello Antonio, uh, sad on the video of the cockapoo with the electric collar. I'm sure he's only basing it on the title. I don't even know this guy. I got rid of him. All right, so. Yay, 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 yay. So she understands that move. The hand going back. Yay. Oh, now she's got a little competition. Oh, this bulldog is... It's not on the top of the list right now. Yeah, and that's kind of my fault, but Yay. they get slippery. So I've kind of got my move now, too. I'll scoot away. Yay, yay, yay. And she's starting to figure out the looking at it thing. Yay, yay. You know, you, you, you've just got to be good at acting. Yay, 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 yay. Anyway, she's doing unbelievable. So, 
you know, if you said, what did you do? And, and, you know, I don't want you guys to think you're just always doing something. You do want to move the story along, though. I just, I do see that's where people go wrong. If I see them and I get them going with something and then I don't see them for a long time, they're still doing the same thing and they didn't move the story along. So it just got boring. You know, it's got, you've got to keep moving the story along. So it's always, we're always sort of headed for the chase scene type of thing. You know, that's just how it's written. It's one of those, uh, it's a series. It's a story, but it's a series, and it's written, you know. It's always ending with the, you know, it's nothing exciting, so. We can go out here and do a little bit of recall with this one, because it's got a lot to go. I'm going to go get the Great Dane. I'll do this one and the Great Dane together, because they do generate, you know, and I do have the luxury of having a lot of different dogs to help generate movement. I understand that. I understand that. So, you know, but you, you've got to, you know, it, there's this one Learberg video where they're, you know, taking this dog outside a dog park. This male, no, i got to find it, show it to you, Mike. It's honestly kind of painful. But, you know, there are ways to use the environment to help generate movement. I mean, if you said that's impossible to do, you're not, yay. You're going to be very good at training dogs. So I'm, I'm looking for the going on the hip, though. When it happens, it's going to happen fast. We should get ready to get the whole basket. I think you've got to have that decided head turn away. Yay. 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 I'd like her to be a little bit closer, though. Yay. My arm isn't that long. You know, and that's what you've got to be careful, Breck. You can't touch the dog because it does, it stays an arm's length away. And I'd like him to really understand. But I'll completely counteract that by going, Because remember when she first did it, she was kind of behind me. So she wasn't actually really completely down, but she was so close to me. I'll tell you who's on the shit list, that bulldog. And I'll tell you who's going to get a collar on before we go down to the punt. That bulldog. Oh, he's awful. Yeah, she likes to pick things up. So, you know, she's probably still going to pick up your shoes. The upside is at least she'll be able to bring them to you now. Yay. All right, so that's exactly what I wanted. But I'm not making eye contact. I'm not telling the dog to do it. This is all new age stuff. You're not even telling them anything. They're just figuring out to do it. Oh, it comes in much more handy. All right, guys, I'm going to go get the other dog, and I'll be right back. But I hope you're impressed with that, Breck, because... Uh, hi, Janice. Oh, I hope you're impressed with that, Mike, because remember, this dog, it was... This was the one I started out with the socks. And for it to actually be getting the big dumbbells. Oh, good accomplishment. My book, you know. Well, I'm sure other people watch it. Oh, that's absolutely stupid. You know, but it's, it's, I think you should try to do that with every dog, just kind of for the sake of them understanding how much you understand about them. You know, there's, if you really have friends, these people understand you. That's why they're your friends, you know. They don't have some complete misunderstanding. All right, I'm going to get the Great Dane. I'll be right back.